So the first step from my morning routine that you guys should all follow is being proactive and not reactive. And what I mean by this is just not going on my phone for the first 30 minutes to an hour before I wake up. So if I go on my phone right away, that puts a reactive state. I'm reacting to the texts I got overnight, the likes on Instagram, the Snapchats, looking at new TikToks, etc. And I'm kind of letting social media and things that other people are saying kind of take priority over like self-care and taking time for myself. Alright guys, so today I woke up at 7.15, so that means I'm probably going to try not to use my phone until 8.15. Also, that first 30 minutes to an hour before you wake up is kind of when your mind is most like vulnerable, I guess. Feed your mind in the morning is really important, and giving yourself positive reinforcement is really good. The next step kind of goes along with this is setting the tone. Setting the tone for a nice relaxing morning. For me, it is lighting candles and turning on my LED lights. For some people, it might be meditation. For some people, it might be lighting incense. But for me, it's turning on my LED lights and lighting my candle. Um, and I just love lighting pumpkin spice candles and turning on my LED lights. It just makes me feel so calm and relaxed. So before I move on to the next tip, I just wanted to say, make sure to go follow my Instagram because whenever a new video goes live, I post on there. The third step of my morning routine that you guys should definitely implement is gratitude and affirmations. So usually after I've set the tone in my room and I'm not on my phone, I like to pull just up my journal straight away and I do a few different journal prompts. They kind of differ from day to day, but here is an example from today. I always put three things I'm grateful for and three things to make today great. But I kind of switch it up sometimes. I do things to look forward to or big rocks, aka like big priorities. And someone else that goes along with gratitude for me is affirmations. So I like to put in my AirPods and listen to some I am affirmations. Affirmations also help to reinforce positive characteristics about yourself. Um, sometimes I like to write my own, but I usually just listen to ones that other people have made on YouTube. But just listening to that in the morning just calms me down. And also I feel super productive because I'm doing that and making my bed. Fourth thing is some kind of movement in the morning. I like to break a sweat pretty much every day, whether it's walking or doing a cardio workout. So this morning I did a full body cardio workout by Sammy Clark. I love her workouts, but seriously, even some days, if I'm really, really tired and sore, I will just do some light stretching. Fifth thing that helps me make my mornings the best they possibly can be is having a filling breakfast. I just did a Sammy Clark workout and now I'm gonna make myself a big yogurt bowl. I'm very excited, I love yogurt. I cannot stress the importance of this. I know some people just don't eat breakfast in the morning, but that could never be me. When I wake up, within the first hour or two, I'm pretty much hungry straight away. So after my workout, especially, I am craving good food, some good protein, something that's gonna fill me up. So so I usually go for oatmeal, a smoothie, or some kind of yogurt. And also hydrating is very essential and important because when you sleep, you lose a lot of water in your body. And it's important to rehydrate yourself right when you wake up, right when I wake up. Yeah, those are the five steps for my morning routine that you guys should totally follow. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!